So now another question is asked about the amount of investment that's going into such things as combined cycle gas-fired turbines for the generation of electricity. And uh, these plants are being put in at the cost of between a billion and two billion dollars. For example, there's a retrofit right now in Sullins Grove, Pennsylvania, in which an old coal-fired power plant is being shut down, the boilers are being taken out, and a gas-fired turbine is being put in with uh, um, a much smaller, much, it's a much more com uh, compact plant. That plant, that retrofit, is going to cost about a billion, $1.2 billion, and, and in terms of an investment for the community of Sullins Grove, this is a tremendous amount of money to, uh, to come along. Now the investment is a very interesting one because investors will count on these facilities running for as much as 30 years to amortize. And of course that means that the uh, investors have to have confidence that gas wells will last for 30 years. And as I've just indicated with, with production, we have reason to believe that, that, that uh, our gas wells in Pennsylvania will be able to supply natural gas for a sufficient length of time to uh, allow these plants to, to amortize.